Hi, my name is Kelly and I'm one of the educators with Bywater Solutions and I have this short tutorial for you, the patron, on how to tag on your public library catalog. Now tagging is a way for you, the user, to add subject terms, descriptions to items in the catalog, which will allow other users to find items that you have tagged or others have tagged a lot easier. Now, if your library allows for tagging, you will have a link to the tag cloud usually found underneath the search bar. So you can see I have a tag cloud right here. I actually can click the tag cloud and I can see any tags that have been placed by other users. Now I can actually see different words and large words and little words. The larger the word, the more times that ha it has been tagged. So if I click this book club tag, I can see that this returns two items. So I wouldn't necessarily, if I search the catalog for book club, find maybe these items, but a user has decided this would be a great way for other, li other users of the library to find books that maybe would be a good idea for a book club. So you can see that these were both tagged with book club. At that point, you can go ahead and place it on hold or search for your, the availability. Now, if you wanted to tag yourself, you do need to log into your account. So we're gonna go ahead and log into my, your account. Once you log in, it will bring you to the your account summary page, but then you do still have this search bar and um, my library is doing a winter bingo card that you can play bingo with and um, mark each book that you have read. One of my um, boxes says cozy mystery. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this book and add a cozy mystery tag to it for others to be able to find it. I think um, some users may not know what cozy mystery is so. Now, I can actually place a tag straight from this brief result. If I didn't want to and I wanted to make sure that this was in fact the book that I think it is, I can actually click the full result and see a little bit more about it. Now see, I don't think any of these subject headings which are from the Library of Congress include something like cozy mystery. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, take this add tag click it and then I'm just going to go ahead and type my tag in. It could be one word, it could be two words. You also have the, abil the ability to add emoji tags. Um, so if you wanted to do that instead of using words you can use emojis to tag. Once you're done you can go ahead and hit add. You can see your tag has been added. Now, some libraries want to moderate your tags, so you may not see them instantly if you were not logged in. You can always see your own tags, but for all others to see your tags, they may have to be moderated and approved by the librarian. So I'm gonna go up here to my tag cloud. And now look, Cozy Mystery's gotten larger. So I'm gonna go ahead and click that and I can see now my book has been included with this um, tag cozy mystery. So that's how easy it is to go ahead and tag and help other users find the books that you love and um, by maybe some descriptions or subject headings you've added. Thank you for watching. This has been a production of Bywater Solutions.